Team Deathmatch. Is any first person shooter truly complete without this game mode? Well, Battlefield 1 has its own version, but with a small tweak that keeps it in tone with the theme of the rest of the game. My name's Westy, and I'm here to tell you all about it. TDM is exactly what it says on the tin. Your team's objective is to simply kill the other team. This harsh brutality really epitomizes what infantry battles could do to different armies in the Great War. Do enough damage to the enemy through sheer numbers alone, and you can force them into a big retreat. Fight across different battlegrounds like the Italian Alps, the deserts of Arabia, the Western Front, and the French countryside, taking on the role of huge armies like the Italians and empires like the Ottomans, as you seek to be overall victorious. I said Battlefield 1 had its own twist though, right? Well, the elite classes come into play in Team Deathmatch. At random intervals, one of these super powerful soldier upgrades will be dropped somewhere within the play zone. If you can grab it and utilize it well, it could be the key to your team's victory. The Flame Trooper in close quarters is extremely effective with its damage over time, and the sentry firing almost endless bullets downrange can pick off enemy after enemy until the cows come home. They do have their weaknesses, so exploit them where you can if you come across one of these elite soldiers. At its core, Team Deathmatch is about who can inflict the most damage. First to eliminate the enemy team wins, or should you need it, the team with the most kills before the timer runs out will emerge victorious. Thanks very much for watching. Make sure you come and check out my channel, youtube.com forward slash Westy. All the Battlefield 1 news, information, and entertainment in one place.